Hi Year 8, um, so I just wanted to have a look at one of the questions on your home learning and there's a couple of grammar points that I think that we maybe weren't sure of and I just wanted to go through these. So this is from your week 4 work, it's task number 2 where you had to choose the correct verb for each of the sentences. Now this one is really tricky because obviously you've had to teach yourselves at home. So I just wanted to talk you through how you would know which one is which based on the grammar from this topic. So the two options that we've got here, we're going to look at when we might use each of those. So for A, me interesa or me interesan. So this works exactly the same as me gusta, me gustan. We know that we need the N when we're talking about more than one thing. So the thing here that we've got is el esqui. That's only one thing. It's el, which is singular, and we've not said anything else. So we only need this one because this is for something that's plural. Okay, so me interesa el esqui means I am interested in skiing or skiing interests me. And it's just the one thing. Right, our next one. Ago means I do and hacer means to do. We know that means to do because it's got an er on the end. We know this one is I do because it's got an o on the end and it's slightly irregular. Odio means I hate and ejercicio is exercise. So we need to have some understanding of the sentence to know which one to choose. So we've now got to look at which ones make more which one makes more sense. I hate, I do exercise doesn't make any sense. But I hate to do exercise does make sense. So we're going to choose that one. This is always the case. If we have an opinion and then a verb, this second verb has to be in the infinitive. So I love to do, I hate to do, I like to sing, I hate to swim, any of those. First verb, I, and then the second verb, to do something. This one is just a case of spelling. So we just needed to know which one is the correct spelling. Preferio or prefiero. This second one is our correct spelling. Now, if you don't know this one, then you just need to get into the practice of that. Unfortunately, there's no other way to do it other than learning your spelling by practicing it. Next one, S or son. S means is and son means are. Okay, so we would use S if we're talking about one thing to say like, I don't know, Spanish is something or son to say students are if we're talking about more than one thing. Here we are talking about la gimnasia, which is gymnastics. So we know that this is singular in Spanish because it's la gimnasia. There's no S's in the Spanish word. And the same are describing words, sana, healthy. There's no indication of it being plural. So we need to use is. Gymnastics in Spanish, we would say gymnastics is healthy because it's a singular word. Juego o jugo al tenis. So we know we're talking about playing uh, tennis. This is a spelling issue and we need to remember that the verb jugar is to play, but it's a three to one verb. So normally we'd take off that AR and put our endings on, but with a three to one verb, we have some spelling changes. So for I play tennis, juego is I play, Hugo is not I play. Me interesa or me interesan el golf. So we have something very similar here in A. We know that if it's talking about one thing, we need the A. More than one thing, we need the N as well. We're looking at el golf. That's one thing. So we're going to choose me interesa again. G is very similar to B. Audio, I hate. And then we've got to play and I play volleyball. I hate, I play volleyball doesn't make any sense. I hate to play volleyball or I hate playing would also work there. Okay, and this one, similar to C, it's just a spelling issue. So we know that it's got emos on the end, but is it preferimos or perferimos? So we can see here that I prefer is pref, we prefer pref. There's no reason why that stem, <coughs> excuse me, 
would change. Pref erimos, we prefer. And again, that's just a case of practicing it so that you remember. Okay, hopefully you have understood a little bit more. Uh, but if you do have any questions about this, please do send me an email so that I can help you more.